Samuel Eto, the president of the Cameroonian Football Federation, FECAFOD, has been hit with a six-month ban by FIFA's disciplinary committee. The ban prohibits him from attending any matches involving Cameroon's national teams, both men's and women's, across all age groups. The decision stems from an incident that occurred during Cameroon's under-20 Women's World Cup match against Brazil in the round of 16 on September 11, 2024, held in Bogota, Colombia. According to FIFA, Eto's behavior during the match violated Articles 13, which is offensive behavior and violation of the principles of fair play, and Article 14, improper conduct by players and officials of the FIFA disciplinary code. The specific details of the incident haven't been disclosed. This is a significant blow to the legendary Cameroonian footballer who has transitioned into a leadership role within the national football scene. The ban prevents him from being physically present at the matches for the next six months, which could limit his ability to influence and inspire the teams. This situation is likely to be a major talking point in Cameroonian and international football circles. Samuel Eto has been in the news of late for all the bad reasons. It's always him going against the government, to be specific, the Ministry of Sports in Cameroon. And this ban just sums up his bad tenure at the helm of Faker Food so far. We just hope that things get right with him and that he gets back on track.